what are the things people who uh or let's say are in our game or whatever might be familiar with new polity and one of the things they talk about a lot is being able to rest and being able to feast right and there being a time for doing those things and philip one thing i've heard you talk about a lot is i want to live a life that's in keeping with the seasons or that's kind of reflective of the seasons of the year and the changing of those patterns and something obviously that we're used to is a timetable that doesn't take into account the time of year it's like you get up say at six o'clock or whatever and you're working at 7 30 and that doesn't take into account the daylight or any of that kind of thing could you maybe talk a little bit about that contrast uh in what your life ideally might be like let's say in your farming lark or whatever or like actual you know what i mean integration into that uh Yeah. as it relates to time of year i'd actually i just want to hear more like something about time there's a time for this time for you know what i'm saying Yeah, I mean, like, it, that's the thing. It's like, okay, you know, winter's coming up. There's going to be less work on the farm. That means there's going to be less food for me to have. Well, you know, I don't really have a normal job anymore. So, well, what the hell am I going to have to do? Well, now I'm going to have to go out and catch things. I'm going to have to fast more, which is what the, ch which is what the church gives us, right? This is why we have a huge fast. during the winter right it's called the it's called the uh you know the the winter lift basically uh the nativity fast right and so i'm going to now right now that i don't have a normal job last year i could do it's like oh okay well i can just go to the grocery store and get some fish for saturday and sunday and that's all fine and dandy well i'm not gonna have the money to do that anymore so i'm gonna have to go and catch fish right i'm gonna have to go cook and clean fish myself not have it nice in a plastic bpa package at the grocery store um right so in a way it's it's beneficial but it's also but it's also a scary process right now i wake up in the morning it's like okay what are we going to eat today it's a question most people don't have most people don't even think about that anymore, right we used to think about it all the time because that's all they had but now that's something i have to now take into consideration it's like less work more fasting okay well now my life is more in conformity with the church calendar it's not just like why you know why am i fasting it's like well I'm working less and therefore I can fast less. So all of these levels are now connecting with, with one another and I can actually sort of enter into it. And then when Christmas comes, right, for example, then, then I can really go all out and, and participate in that feast because I've been, I've been saving, saving lots of money. I've been eating a lot less food. Um, I've been, you know, not doing as much work out in the field. Right. And now and in preparing and saving up for that, for that rejuvenation, for that, right because winter is a, a descent into death the, the whole world dies together right and then when the light comes right it's like a little resurrection right the light has come it's takes christmas takes place at the time of the solstice um and so now things start to come back uh no solstice is the right it's not the right word it's the equinox whatever it is um everything comes back up to and it's the winter solstice everything comes back up together so it's like okay i get to plug into that for the first time in my entire life i've been allowing for 26 years and this is the only time I've ever been able to do it.